Hey traders. Okay, so a few days ago I created a video that's in front of you right now, which was the free cryptocurrency pump and dump group video. Now I kind of rushed that video because I wanted you guys to experience a pump that was scheduled nine hours after the release of the video. Now um, I'm com somewhat disappointed about this and, I, and I'm kind of regretting having put this up simply because I think um, I'm quite naive in thinking that humans um, can be trustworthy. Unfortunately, the experience that has come through something like this has kind of been disappointing that um, there's a lot of greed involved. So um, I'm hoping that you guys took the advice that just observe that actual pump, don't be a part of it. Um, now the thing is this, that the whole idea behind something along these lines was to coordinate an actual pump or inflation of the underlying value of an asset um, temporarily so that the price goes up and then you attract attention from other investors within bigger exchanges um, that come in, pump money into it so price goes up further. You make some money off the inflation but at the same time then you, you've got a whole heap of buyers as well for the stock that you have. You sell them a large portion, you um, get your initial principal back, you make some profit, but at the same time then you're also adding some unit assets to your balance sheet. That's the whole point. That's the discussions that I had. And some of the results that I was shown showed something similar to that. Unfortunately, what I experienced was a one minute pump and then an instant dump. And at the at, at the same time, the admins took positions prior to releasing the information. So they made a, a killing out of it um, and within the pecking order where they actually do give people um, a few second advantage in um, getting that information before the rest of the members do. So what they're doing essentially is setting up the members to fail. That This system doesn't work. Um, I've waited a few days to come out with more research in regards to this whole pump and dump uh, arena None of it works. I've had so much spam come through after that video that uh, you know YouTube has constantly been sending me um, messages to clear f clear the filter. Um, I've done. I've gone through so many of them, deleted it, um, and I've deleted stuff that actually has made it in the comment section. I've received emails about all of this stuff. So um, no more, no more of these scams. So the other thing that I've done now as a result of this is to say. Well, the whole purpose behind my channel was to circumvent the scams that existed within the Forex and binary options arena. Um, I, I, to be honest with you, guys, once I retired from the finance world, I really just wanted to um, do my own thing, you know, learn music, travel the world, um, trade and invest for myself, um, do that sort of stuff, um, as, you know, spiritual stuff. But... Unfortunately, like I've come back here because there's just so many scams going on and what I'm finding is that within the crypto world, it's the same amount. So um, here's, here's some warnings. First of all, um, don't exchange um, private or personal information with strangers over the internet. Please don't buy cryptocurrencies from, the, from places like eBay, from places like uh, Amazon or any other third party purchasing site. Please do not deal with crappy new exchanges that have very low volume because you kind of you have your money stuck there for a while. Be aware of the number in terms of dollar value and fees that you will be charged for purchasing, for exchanging, for selling. Right, that's that is extremely important. Um, also, start educating yourself in terms of. Uh, the value of something in relation to, say, Bitcoin or in relation to the US dollar in relation to Ether. Um, also start to st understand in regards to the type of asset that is coming on board in, in regards to um, cryptocurrencies. You've got infrastructure, you've got applications, you've got currency. So that sort of stuff. And I, I understand that there's just so much info there. But what I'd like for you guys to focus on right now is to not be scammed, right? Don't don't go onto websites and put in personal information or 
to um, exchange if there is not a, a secured section on the site. There's no padlock up here within the browser or it doesn't have like an SSL certificate or something along those lines. If, if a service cannot afford security of that nature, it's probably a scam, right? So that sort of stuff. The other thing is that in the last few days, I've really spent time thinking about how do we circumvent some of the, the scam stuff that's going on within the crypto world? And so how do we help? So it just, the only thing that I keep coming back to um, in regards to everything to do with finance is knowledge. My primary goal with all of you is for you guys to become as knowledgeable as you possibly can, because that, that also helps me. That's my whole idea isn't just to kind of establish a trade copier somewhere and then we blindly, you know, um, go about me taking trades and you guys just you know reap the benefits of the money because I'm not going to be doing that all of the time remember I'm already retired I don't want to hold a day job again um, so and I've also I've also had a number of emails um, in particular people have said to me Shiva why are you encouraging people to be lazy why because when, when once you do the trade copy stuff um, it's, it's not going to work um, the thing here is this my primary goal with all of you is for you guys to become as knowledgeable as you possibly can. I'd like to get to a stage within a year and two years or three years where I have a network of you guys who have um, made enough money through Forex trading, uh, possibly also the crypto world right now, um, that have large stock portfolios, that ha have learned enough about business to be able to say, yes, I'm going to establish businesses, establish companies, and via your knowledge, you will start to change, and your wealth that you and your resources, you'll start to change and affect um, the community that you live in. And for me, the benefit would be networks. I'll have a network of all of you guys around the world, and together we can go out there and say we're going to change the world. But if it's just me here that's going to trade and you guys won't be able to kind of put in any effort, that's going to fall apart whenever, say, for instance, I get hit by energy, I'm tired, I'm you know, traveling or whatever it is, I won't be able to function. So that is what my goal is. And I really need you guys to work with me here. I want you guys to learn from me. See, I, I get, I've shared my phone number with, you, with a number of you, and I get stupid questions via phone messages asking about personal stuff, about, you know, at calls at three in the morning at two in the morning that sort of stuff just doesn't work for me what i want you guys to do is become the best version of yourselves and i will be happy to share as much information as i possibly can with you guys to get you guys to that level where you guys are solid just within yourself so here's what i'm going to do i'm going to kick start in 2018 i'm technically still on holidays but i'm going to be back um in my in my home office on the 16th so that's when my trading and everything kicks off again so here's the thing um, I'm gonna coordinate with someone um, her name's Tina and so she's she works within the investment banking field still um, not retired but will be soon and the whole and she's an analyst as well or background um, being an analyst so her and I are going to coordinate and we're going to bring in a couple of other people as well. So this is going to free up some time for me. The idea, first of all, is to create this year a knowledge base. And that knowledge base will be everything from Forex to stocks to um, cryptocurrencies to business methods and models. Um, so it's, I'm going to effectively kind of teach you guys everything from whatever knowledge you'll gain from having an MBA to some legal concepts, to um, how to calculate, how to uh, begin to um, value companies and value stock, um, how to look for dividend yielding stock, to cryptocurrencies. So the whole idea will also be to teach you, okay, where's the money within crypto, uh, within the crypto world? And that would be in pre-sales, within ICOs, um, and then to also look at how uh, to do the calculations between supply within demand within um, the ICO market cap, overall market cap, where the market's going, valuation, uh, products, teams, 
um, what breaking breaking down the product into whether it's it's part of infrastructure, whether it's an application to do something, whether it's a currency, um, and then also from a business uh, point of view, to what's what's that product actually doing? Because one of the key things to to know here is that yes, the blockchain technology that is the underlying wealth of everything that you see, whether it's currencies, whether it's uh, tokens that are coming out within the crypto world, it's the blockchain te te technology that's priceless. And everything that you see being built upon that is what's going to change the world. So uh, right now, it would be naive for us to think that the massive corporations aren't already utilizing blockchain, blockchain technology. They're all working on it right now because it simplifies a lot of things. Keep in mind also, blockchain technology will start to utilize artificial intelligence eventually. So for many of you, here's now the time to become more knowledgeable to start creating wealth for yourself because this technology is what's going to take your jobs eventually. It's happening at a such a fast rate. But within the next 12 years or so, many of the normal jobs that exist right now probably won't exist anymore. So now's the time to kind of utilize some of this information, make as much money, start living a life away from, you know, running around chasing your tail um, with a nine to five job, that sort of stuff. So that knowledge base will be possibly uh, videos. Um, I'm going to redo connectwithshiva.com. I'm going to try and add a forum to that as well so that we can actively share to get things together as a community. Um, and we're going to bring in a number of people that are uh, quite knowledgeable in different areas. I, I'm a business guy, I'm a finance guy, I'm a trader, but I'm not a, a someone in the crypto world. I, I'm an analyst, uh, and I will utilize that information to be able to analyze as, as deeply as I possibly can. Um, ICOs, project teams, project heads, um, the vision that these people have, the industry that they're trying to disrupt, that sort of stuff. And then we will try, Tina and I will try and break that down into a one pager or two pager and then to shoot it out to you guys. At this stage, I don't know how to share that with you, whether it's going to be a Telegram group mixed with um, a forum and then articles off the website and videos here, or if there's going to be something else. If you guys have some ideas, please let me know. Um, also, a couple of things. Um, the big money when it comes to cryptocurrencies is through being part of pre-sales, right? Um, pre-sales happens before the ICOs happen. So one of the things that's key with pre-sales is they're looking for big investors, right? And as you probably are aware, that there's also a lot of risk when it comes to investing in um, projects within the ICO world, well, projects within the cryptocurrency world. And so the best way to possibly partake in something that is a legit project um, whereby you get the best market rate that you possibly can uh, for that underlying token, whatever is part of that project, would be to partake in a pre-sale. So uh, what we'd probably eventually start to do is to put together pools. And pools will basically mean that we might have, you know, either put together like... Um, 20 to 50 Bitcoin worth or 100 Ether or so or, you know, 500,000 NEO or something along those lines, band together as a group and then be able to partake within the pre-sales. And this is like before anyone else gets access to that. And then you get the better rate, that sort of stuff. We'll put all of that together and Tina and I will work out a ma ma manner in which to, to do all of that. Um, and when that happens, um, either her or I will release... Um, our personal information, passport details, uh, physical addresses, um, phone numbers and things like that. And um, we'll have um, people here that will also release information that will meet me in person and verify me so, by, so that everyone is secure, that sort of stuff. Um, so, and then there's whitelists. So whitelists are basically where uh, some of these projects what they do is they'll release their, their project and their information out. You've got to sign up with these whitelists, which oftentimes, um, you know, if they would only have a hard cap of a certain amount, um, the number of people willing to invest would be like 10 times whatever would fill the hard cap. And, it, you know, in, in being able to be a part of that project, oftentimes, like it's, you need, you can only do it if you were in a whitelist and, 
you get an allotment um, of like um, units and a, a certain number of units within that project. So it's it's getting to that level of complexity. So what what first stage is knowledge base. Second stage is to create also doing a um, a team of analysts where we'll be doing research behind all of this and then releasing it to you guys. And then also for like great projects where we'd have to then register with the uh, with whitelists and then be able to um, partake within the, the pre-sale pool, okay, or, or the pre-sale via our own pool, that sort of stuff. Now, what I want from you guys is to let me know how interested you are, you guys are in something like this because um, I, I will be eventually paying people to or hiring people to do certain stuff. Um, I will see from the 16th, I will be putting a, a certain amount of hours into work like this every day. Um, so that's the whole point in me asking you guys. Um, I don't want to make too much of an effort if you guys are not going to be interested in something along these lines. My services in this regard, in regards to knowledge, um, will all be free. Okay. Um, and okay. And lastly, the other thing is I really do need to know also uh, whether it be business, whether it be to do with trading, whether it be with stocks, um, what sort of information that you guys will really need. From what I have written down, what I'm expecting to do is to kind of break everything down into like little bit, bits and pieces, like five, 10 minute videos or short articles that will explain everything from um, how to do a trial balance, how to uh, calculate something, how to understand, you know, market cap, for example. Um, blockchain technology, I'm still kind of working on the easiest method to explain to you guys in detail. And not only that, I'm actually right now in search for um, simple courses that would be able to help you guys um, learn how to work with uh, blockchain technology, even to the point where for some of you, I really encourage you, I'm going to be doing it this year myself, where I'm going to actually be doing some courses on C++ um, as well. Um, so that at some stage that I'm going to be actively, like I'm, I'm not going to develop stuff, but I really do like having the knowledge to be able to um, understand in depth what's going on. So courses in with, to do with blockchain as well. Um, I, I, to, to, to be honest with you, I really don't know what, what uh, programming language uh, this technology is built upon um, or used to, to be built. So I'm just throwing C++ out there, but we'll look at all of those things. So... Please, in the, in the um, section below, um, let me know your ideas. Do you guys want a forum um, um, with the knowledge base? Would you like um, me to just kind of stick it up onto the website? Um, do you guys want a Telegram group for that? Um, with Forex itself, there will be no signals. I don't believe in the signals simply because there's not always a set time that I'm trading, nor can I give you guys a entry without a confirmation. Um, with the signal providers, they speculate about a confirmation, and that's why you get a, a lower amount in, in terms of um, the in, in the money percentage rates. So what I will do eventually would be webinars as such, but the idea is to get you guys to become the best traders that you possibly can. And once a trade copier is established, that will tie in with my schedule. It wouldn't be where I'm sitting there every single day and trading, there will, because it just works differently when I'm doing it for a group. So there'll be analysts involved, there'll be, I'll be doing a lot of um, um, analytical work there as well. And then there might be a set, set number of pips that we're chasing on a weekly, monthly basis. So there's gonna be no schedule to that. And, and again, that is just gonna be a bonus. It cannot be, excuse me, it cannot be something that you rely upon, right? Again, my goal is for you guys to become the best that you possibly can within this. And within that arena as well, there's going to be a lot of videos. I'm going to really now break down fundamentals, break down candlestick patterns, break down uh, the understanding behind like a setup. You guys, I know, are, are wanting that. Um, run you through actual setups and say, okay, this is what's going on and this is why this is happening, that sort of stuff so that it becomes more and more in depth, okay? The other thing I'd like you guys to do going off 
all of my Forex videos in the past. I want you guys to come back and write down what your favorite setups are because what I want to do this year is possibly go go ahead and create maybe um, two to four maximum setups that I'm going to constantly um, uh, create videos about. So, and, and what I will do is create live videos about just these setups, run you through the psychology over and over and over and over again. So the only thing that you guys end up trading is just that two to four setups. There'll be nothing else that we kind of look at, okay? So let's, let's do that. Please let me know. Um, and in the meantime, I'll have a chat with Tina as well, and we're going to put together um, probably a program, um, a schedule of when we'll outlay all of this, um, and then we'll go from there. All right, guys, so um, still on holidays. Uh, emails, responses will start to happen from the 16th. Uh, well, 17th. Um, and also, can I just ask, for those of you that have my personal phone number, um, could you please kind of just use that for emergencies and, um, you know, just, let's put it this way, I, you know, I get a lot of calls at odd hours of the night and day um, with some silly messages and the like. Um, I don't want to be rude to you guys, but at the same time, like, I, I know I understand different cultures, different types of people kind of, I, my personal space, uh, family time, all of that, um, please do respect it. I enjoy uh, do, working with you guys in this way, but just keep in mind, like, I gain nothing from it. So I get a lot of burnout um, as a result of, like, all the unnecessary stuff. So um, please do kind of respect that. If there's stuff that you guys really need to get to me, uh, email is the best way. I read every single email that comes through. I may not be able to respond um straight away or at all but i do read every single email that comes through all right guys all right so um enjoy the rest of the weekend and we'll be back at it on the 16th and then from that on point onwards uh, a lot of stuff will begin to happen all right guys thank you